Hi, this is um, the help movie for Chapter 8, Problem Solve 1. We're going to work on step number 8. So in this particular scenario, this Ian McShane, who's participant ID, ID 3, has notified pause, Putts for Paws that he has to withdraw from the event. So you have been asked to remove him from the tables in the database. <clears throat> so this is that scenario where a participant in the participant table might have, um, with the participant table being the one, might have records in associated many um, tables, right? So in the one-to-many relationship, participant three may exist. So if you're going to move remove him from the one, you need to make sure you remove all of the corresponding um, records. So we're going to go up to database tools first and look at our relationship. So here's our participant table. So it looks like participant role, order, and orders. Okay, um, so. <clears throat> I'm going to dub double click on the line between participant and order, cascade updates. I'm sorry, cascade deletes. I'm going to go to the line between participant and participant orders, cascade. And then I would do this one. Oh, this one already had it on it. That's why we didn't need to do it. But it's worth checking. So I double check double clicked and it already had cascade deletes. So now all three connectors to participants have the cascade delete switch activated. So when we remove participant three from the participant table, any record in order, participant order, or participant role that's attached to participant three is going to be gone. So we're going to save that and we're going to close that. So, uh, get rid of all, we did all that. Create a delete query that will remove participant three from table participant table. So we're gonna create a query in design view and use the participant table. And really the only field I need is participant ID because the criteria would be that it's participant three, right? Because we only want Ian McShane, which is participant three. So if I don't not run it, I'm gonna come over to view. I should just get that single record that says three. So we're good. I'm gonna switch it to delete. That switches this to the where, and now I can run it. It tells me it's gonna remove one row, one record, Yes. I'm going to save this. It's going to be called Query Delete Participant. Okay. So the big thing with the deletes is that you have to evaluate the relationships. And that's really when you're deleting something from a table that is a one on the one to many you have to um, kind of flow down. So the, like the parent, the participant table is the parent and the other ones were the children. So you can't, you, you don't want to orphan those children. So you have to connect them. So when you delete the parent, the children get deleted also. We're going to go ahead and close that. And we are all done with this query. And next one will be step nine.